Singapore's relationship with Italy spans decades. Diplomatic ties between both countries were established when Singapore gained independence in 1965 and continues today in the form of economic collaborations. Today, Singapore companies are interested and active in Italy, said President Thaman Shanmugaram on June 23 at a reception for overseas Singaporeans in Rome. For example, port operator PSA runs the two largest container terminals in Genoa and Venice. While GIC has significant investments in Italy, including a data centre that runs fully on renewable energy in Milan, he said. The two countries have also deepened relationships in science and technology. In 2023, the Executive Programme for Scientific and Technological Cooperation saw projects in areas such as food tech and artificial intelligence jointly led by principal investigators from both Italy and Singapore. ST Microelectronics, a French-Italian company, has also been a key player in Singapore's electronics sector for decades, going back to the 70s. Mr. Thaman said, it's a relationship that goes back a long time. But it's being refreshed and renewed. And we are deepening our relationship. The president was speaking at the reception as part of his working visit to Italy. The reception was attended by around 30 Singaporeans who live, study, or are travelling in Italy. According to the Italian embassy website, there is a growing community of more than 5,000 Italians living and working in Singapore. Mr. Thaman met Pope Francis on June 22 and attended the group of 30 G30 plenary session where he spoke as a panellist on the future of fiscal policy. Mr. Thaman chairs the G30 board. He also attended the Global Commission on the Economics of Water GCW of which he is one of four co-chairs. The GCEW examines and makes recommendations to the United Nations and other international forums on how societies govern and use water. On June 24, he made an official visit to meet his Italian counterpart Sergio Mattarella, as well as Italian Prime Minister Giorgio Meloni. His official visit is the first presidential-level visit to Italy since former President Tony Tang in 2016. Mr. Thaman said, It's an important time to be here in Italy. We are really in very uncertain times, with major wars continuing unabated, at tremendous human cost. He added that the political mood in Europe has shifted. And that Italy which currently holds the Group of Seven Presidency, plays an important role. Mr. Thaman is accompanied on his trip by his spouse, Ms. Jane Itogi, as well as Minister in the Prime Minister's Office Maliki Osman, Minister of State for Trade and Industry Alvin Tan, and MP Saito Yiping and Cheryl Toho. Mr. Thaman will travel to Estonia at the invitation of Estonian President Ella Keres on June 25.